There's breaking news just coming in. Reports of fighting taking place on streets of Sumi. Residents are now asked to stay at home or go to a safe place as Putin's invasion enters day 10. Gaurav Savant with this breaking news now joining us for the latest. Uh, Gaurav, on the back of this particular breaking news that's coming in of reports of fighting taking place on the streets of Sumi uh, and the residents being asked to uh, either stay at home or go to a safe place. What is the nearest safe place that they can go to? Basements of their buildings, nearest underground station, inside any location, inside any building. Uh, that's the only way they can stay safe. And remember, Sumi is a place where you have about 700 uh, or close to 700, between 500 and 700 in the students who may be trapped uh, inside uh, Sumi. Uh, till till yesterday, we were in touch with some, uh, uh, some medical students in Sumi who were waiting for this humanitarian corridor to be set up. Uh, Russia claimed they were ready for this humanitarian corridor. Uh, we were waiting for... Uh, for a word uh, from the ICRC, uh, Ukraine, in principle, both countries have agreed. But on ground, you're looking at, this, the, at the latest information that is coming in, that fierce fighting has broken out for control of Sumi. And it, this, again, is a very crucial town, uh, uh, city, en route Kiev. So, uh, you know, what is happening on ground right now is Russia is not only sending in the majority of its forces to squeeze Kiev from multiple directions, it's also destroying all pockets of resistance en route so that once its main forces focus on Kiev, there is no attack from behind. That appears to be the strategy uh, and, and that is why uh, they've cut off the Black Sea coast uh, uh, as far as Ukraine is concerned to ensure they do not get relief, supplies, reinforcements or any other material coming in from uh, the Black Sea or the Sea of Azov. Uh, they're cutting off entire east. We've reported on the situation in Mariupol and in Kharkiv. The same is happening now in Sumi uh, as Russian forces advance. In Sumi, there are reports that uh, uh, Pitched battles are taking place in street corners. Russians trying to take control and uh, the Ukrainians trying to push them back. Very, very bitter street-by-street street battle is being reported uh, from, from the information that we've been able to get from Sumi. Uh, but uh, again, the main assault is likely to happen in this place. The question still remains, how will the Indian students who are trapped in Sumi be retrieved uh, if this humanitarian corridor is not agreed to? Because today, it, it was hoped that today, that humanitarian corridor will be uh, cleared for people to leave. It, it appears, God forbid, that they may be trapped for longer. That's correct.